Hey guys, it's Allie Jo, and today I'm going to read uh, the poem To Be of Use by Margie Piercy on page 1039. And as I read this poem, think about what the title To Be of Use means to you and how you think it connects to the poem. The people I love the best jump into work head first without dallowing in the shallows and swim off with short strokes almost out of sight. They seem to become natives of that element, the black silk heads of seals, bouncing like half-submerged balls. I love people who harness themselves, an ox to a heavy cart, who pull like water buffalo, with massive patience, who strain in the mud and the muck to move things forward to do what has to be done again and again. I want to be with people who submerge in the task, who go into the fields to harvest and work in a row and pass bags along, who are not pearl generals and field deserters, but move in a common rhythm when the food must come in or the fire be put out. The work of the world, world is common as mud, Botched, it smears the hands, crumbles to dust. But the thing worth doing well done has a shape that satisfies clean and evident. Greek and or furs for wine or oil, hoffy vases that help that held corn are put in museums, but you know they were made to be used. The pitcher cries for water to carry, and a person for work that is real. So, as I read that poem, how did you connect the title to it? I connected the title. At first, I was like, I didn't really know. Because, I mean, it says in here why, basically. It, it basically tells you why the title is to be of use. Because she's basically saying, I love people who like to be of use, so people who like to work. But I was hoping I could find something less general. So I kept reading and I read it over a few more times, but every time, that's what I came back to. The title at first to me just makes me think, okay, it's somebody who wants to do something, doesn't want to sit around the house, kind of like we all have to right now. They want to be doing work. And when I read the poem, I, that's what I heard. That not uh, that she, the speaker, as much as wants to be of use, but the people she loves. She wants them to love work. So maybe not put her first, but what they love to do first also. So in the next video... I'm going to talk about how metaphors relate to this poem, the ones I found in this poem, and how they kind of relate back to what 